Moving on to table three drills. Table three drills allow soldiers to get maximum repetitions in each position, reloading, malfunctions, things of that nature. And we provide an open floor space known as multi-purpose space one. And then we also provide additional barricades to help with that supplemental table one PMI and E for the fundamentals and the positions and marksmanship. Pull, rolls into your IWQ. And then there's plenty of space here to do your bore lighting and your optics and your iron sights things of that nature that also rolls into table one. So you can see the round robin effect here is all in one location in the vicinity. With the barricades, it also allows you to go through what I would consider to be more advanced marksmanship, the prone rollover, reverse rollovers, and then it just has a comfortable environment for soldiers to go through the weapons manipulations and the workspace management of doing your reloads and getting the weapon back into the fight and understand the transitions and positions of, hey, I'm here, now I'm here, but I need to get back up and get moving because eventually we have to move, we can't just sit in one spot, right? So it allows them to have a fluid transfer of positions with the weapons management and manipulations and length in a controlled environment that allows them to have plenty of practice before they go into the EST or before they go into another event of some sort. It also allows the fact that you can have a very controlled case for weapons malfunctions. Because those things, you need to take time for those. And having the, uh, the training rounds also helps with that. And then that enforces your immediate action drills and your remedial action drills to get the weapon back into the fight to effectively put rounds on target.